What is going on, my guys? Lil Tekka, Lil Tekka, Lil Tekka. You guys heard him. I got black, I got white, what you want. Simple, melodic, bangers. That's what we're doing today. If you guys haven't already subscribed, go ahead and click that red button down below. Do not forget to hit the notification bell so you won't miss any content. With that being said, let's go straight into FL Studio and make a melodic banger for somebody like Lil Tech. Alright guys, so you guys know me, I always fuck things up and I forgot to change the audio settings. So the melody wasn't recorded, but... I went back and found all of the sounds just so you guys can see how I made it. I'm going to walk you through right now. So, first thing I did was open up FL Keys. And let's change this to a sampler. And put FL Keys. First thing I did was open up FL Keys. And then I got a very simple chord progression going on. And that sounded something like this. And usually the way I come up with those is I usually just start off right on the root note of the first. This is in the key of A minor natural, I believe. Yeah, A minor natural. And then just go up, skip one, and then do the same thing until I get something that sounds good. The next thing I did was add some bass notes down here. Just the root notes of what's going on right here. Like this, just like that. All right, just the, the first note of each chord and then I duplicated that and knocked that down an octave too just to fill the uh, frequency range just a little more and then I added some passing notes just to give this uh, some more life and some more swing the second thing I did was start to add in some sounds all of these sounds are out of atmosphere the first one is called Bell Oscobar from Palace's fourth bank and that sounds like this the first three sounds I actually just use the same MIDI the only sound that doesn't use this MIDI from the piano was the lead and that was after everything else so so the first bell sounds like this very very simple very playful and actually the uh, the transients of some of these bells also kind of play as a, a slight like percussion at the same time if that makes sense somewhere in between a melody and a, and a percussion so the second sound i got um, like I said, same MIDI is called uh, Bell Birds and is out of Kit Plug Status Bank. That sounds like this. I liked it because I felt like there's like a lot of texture, a lot of space, especially with the wheel, wheel, wheel. It's very subtle in the background. So with the first melody, that sounds like this. third sound that I added in was a piano. It's called Flea. It's out of Pharaoh Vice's and Taz Taylor's Vigil Bank. It's, like I said, same MIDI. That sounds like this. What I did was pretty much just duplicate the same pattern and then knock it an octave up and then just put the volume down just to blend it in and give the sample some more high end. And then all together with the rest of the sounds, that sounds like this. Okay, so at this point, I'm like, all right, we've got somewhere. We got a nice little chord progression, very simple, but I still feel like it was missing something. So I was like, you know what? Let me go ahead and look for a flute of some sort, an omnisphere, just to add some more direction to this sample and I came across this preset right here it's called flute arrow and palaces uh, eighth atmosphere bank and I pretty much um, I wasn't really even going for a kind of you know I, I guess island kind of vibe but just the way some of these sounds came together has just a little bit of Caribbean you know a little bit of Caribbean spice in there so here's the melody right here And that's pretty much it. That's the that that's the main lead of this beat. So here's what all these sounds sound like together. Oof, 
that's fire. Okay, now let's get to the drums. All right, I like that right there. We can go ahead and just loop these over. can go to advanced looping here we go something like that could do this baseline right here control C control V two octaves up go lower on this one Add like a little slide right here, maybe something like this. And we go up to an F, so maybe, I mean, I mean a G. an octave up right here and we can extend this out and then maybe add a slide like that maybe add another note right here lower the volume can add like a slide note right here mm, these notes really don't let's see and we can add a nice little kick add a nice little kick to this put the volume all the way up. Get the mix and the 808 relationship right. We all know how important that is. And honestly, I'm just gonna copy the 808 pattern. I don't wanna go too crazy with this. Something like that. Now we can uh, turn the velocity up. Finish these hi-hats real quick. I want to go with like just just very very simple hi hat. See something like that, bro. Something like that. You don't gotta go too crazy, bro. Maybe.
hey, just like that, we're done with these. We're done with this right here. What you gotta do is arrange this, and then we're done, man. We're done, so control B, control B, control B, control B. And now we can do something like this. You can take the piano out and leave it like this. Something like that. There we go. Right? And then we'll have it come back in, drop all the drums, leave the clap. Keep the hi-hats, keep the energy going. Carry the snare over, the snare, carry the, the kick over, and actually the, the main lead too. And then all we gotta do is drag this back over, and then that's the beat right there. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for pulling up. If you guys haven't already subscribed, you go ahead and click that red button down below. Do not forget to hit the notification bell. I'm gonna mix this beat and play it for you guys in like two seconds. Thank you guys again. I'll see you guys next time.